Hello, my Basset Hound friends and my sexy little guy cuties. Mark the Punk Gamer, aka Mark the Punk here. And yes, this is another I got from online stuff, number four this time. This is actually going to be a special one because um, this is actually going to be an awesome one. But I forgot two items I forgot to show you in my last one, uh, which is a PS2 game and a DVD movie. I forgot to mention my last one. So I'll start off with this one. It's a PS2 game. Yeah, Rats Unleashed. This is a strategy and fighting game. So this game is actually pretty fun. Um, yeah, you guys want to uh, let me know in the comments why you guys want to see me do a playthrough of it. So, uh, yeah, Wrath Unleashed. So it was the case was dented on the, uh, when I got from Arrival. I I swapped it for a different beautiful clear case like that so you can actually see it so it looks brand new to you guys so uh yeah rest unleash it's a strategy fighting game so i got a little bit into it i still need to get into this game so uh, uh let me know if you guys want to see a playthrough of this in the future let me know so rest unleash on the fist all right this is another this is a dv movie that i got from ebay actually for brand new you might be shocked this came, so yeah, Prison Miller would be shocked I have this now. So this is also part two. Yes, unrated director's cut. Just like my first one. So yes, I got part two. There's no way in hell I'm not getting part three. It's not happening. But what I saw on eBay, there's actually a triple collection of this, by the way, unrated on eBay. All three of them are all unrated if you guys want to get that. So triple the collection of this. But yeah, also part two. Yes, this is the more gorier version than the first one. I know that. This is probably Prison Miller's favorite out of the three. I tend to agree for him a little bit. I still like the first one, which I still have on my shelves. But for some reason, this one has more features. Look at that. Than the first one. A lot more features. I haven't checked out the features of this one yet, so... It gives me nostalgia for this one. I just like the first two that I have in my collection, I guess. So, this one has a lot more features than my first one. So. There you go, Hostel Part 2. I forgot to mention this in my last video, so I own it now. On to the main event you guys are looking forward to. Now, here it is, guys. You like to be surprised what this box contains, actually. And your answer right now is 10 random CDs rock, metal, etc. type ones. So these are random 10, and they're also brand new as well. And uh, you guys are wondering. They're not used like very good or anything. These are all brand new. I'm never going to know what I'm going to get from this box. So, as you can see, I've already teared out the, um, the address and stuff, so I'm going to find me. So, uh, smart thing I did that. Anyway, so this is a mystery box. So I'm never going to know what I'm get. These are my first 10. Oh boy, I'm actually looking forward to know what I'm going to get, so here we go. I'm not supposed to look at the box. I'll pull up my first one. Where is it? Ah, this I guess this is my first one. Oh, what the hell? Look at this. Grave something. What the hell? Um... Uh, Grave Misima. Here it is. I think this might be Death Metal, guys. That's awesome. I The cover looks sick. Grave, whatever the band's called. Um, that is fucking cool. I've never heard of them before, to be honest. I never did. Now, this is a sick-ass cover, too. It's brand new. I've never heard of Grave something. So let me know in the comments below if you guys want me to get into it. Oh. There's too much reflection, so here you go. That's what the cover looks like. I guess I'll show you what the back looks like, the track listing and stuff. Oh, it's just names of um, production, whatever. This looks sick as hell. I don't know if this is an EP or a full album. I don't know. So, Grave Messia something. Awesome album. Pretty cool in my collection. I don't know if they're death metal. I'm not supposed to look at the box. At least the newspaper is walking it. I'm seeing it. All right, my second one. What's this? Oh, what the hell? Uh, <laughs> um, 
This is Black Cobra, whatever the hell, Imperium Similarica. I've never heard of this. <laughs> so that's interesting. Um, are they a punk band? Uh, it says Mastodon on it. Black. Oh. Now that is cool, actually. Her hair looks like um, the plug-in for an amp. That's pretty cool. Um, Black Cobra. So this is interesting. Here's a track listing. So uh, this might be an EP or a compilation. I am not sure. You guys can tell me that in the comments below. So uh, Black Cobra. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Third one. What the hell? Um, I don't know this band's name. Uh, Genus... Oh, Genus Talk. Well, here you go. It's Genus Talk. And the album name is called... Engineering the Rule. Now that's cool. It includes, um... Um, what's the band's called? I have no idea, I'm sorry. So, this is very cool. Has an atmospheric cover to it. Like a meteor or a volcano or something. Now that's very cool. I've never heard of this before either. So uh, here's a track listing. Now that is legit. I've never heard of this. <laughs> that's cool. So uh, it's uh, Gene Nuss Talk. That's the name of the band, I guess. Or it's EP or a compilation. You guys can help me out in the comments below. Um, I don't know any of this, okay? So here you go. Dean us talk. There you go. Time for a fourth one. Let's see. What the hell? What the hell is this? Oh, floor um, oblation. What the hell is this? Floor oblation. What the hell is this? Is that some sort of... Um, Frickin' whatever the hell this is. Here's another track listing. What the hell is this? I have no idea. Again, you guys can help me out in the comments below. I don't know what the hell this is. <laughs> so, the band is called Floor, I guess. I have no fucking clue. But anyway, Floor, whatever the hell it's called, uh, Oblation. So, there you go. So that's the fourth one. Fifth one. What am I gonna get this time? Oh, um, uh, this is Ritual Killer Exterminations. Exterminates. I think that's the name. I think so, yeah. Now, this is a cool cover, to be honest. I've never heard of this one. It has goat whore, apparently. <laughs> that's awesome. So that's what it's called, right? Ritual Killer. Uh, I think it's Exterminance. Yeah. Now that's cool. I don't know if this is a first print or a reissue. I have no idea. Uh, it's 2015. It's different. Look at the back of it. There's no track listing or nothing. Now that's cool. So I own a black type CD. That's awesome. Again, let me know in the comments below. This is a, one of the coolest ones I have so far. Next to the other one. That's fucking cool. I like that. So, the album is called Ritual Killer Exterminance. So, there you go. One, two, three, four, five. That's five. Five more to go. Six, one. Oh, dude! I think I heard a little bit of this before. I can't remember. It's called Black Sheep Wall No Matter Where It Ends. Here it is. That's a sick cover. Look at that shit. Now that's awesome. I don't know if they're black metal, death metal. This is a, one of the coolest covers in my opinion. <laughs> black sheep wall. So there you go. Baba black sheep. Have you, had, have you had any wool? Now that's awesome. There's a track listing. There you go. That's one of the sickest ones I have so far. I haven't and when I get the chance to listen to uh, one of these I have, um, I'll let you guys know. <laughs> so, Black Sheep Wall. 
uh, no matter where it ends. There you go. That's fucking sick. That's awesome. That's the sixth one. Seventh one. What am I gonna get? Oh, dude. Dark Throne something. Uh, it's hard to pronounce this name, but I'll show it to you anyway. There you go. This looks very nice, actually. I've never heard of this band either. I think my guess might be... Hmm, I think they might be black metal. So, uh, I can't pronounce the name, guys. You guys can help me. There's a track listing. This might be a digi pack or something. I think that, yeah. It includes a DVD, no way. Oh, yeah. Is it upside down? Oh, it includes a DVD with it. That's cool. I think they might be black metal. You guys can help me out what the band name is. This looks sick. I like this one, too. It has a black atmosphere to it. So it includes a DVD, apparently. That's awesome. So, next one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I got three more to go. Sad. Um, what's my next one? Venomous what? <laughs> Venomous concept. Um, something. Kick me silly. There it is. Venomous concept. <laughs> I think this might be a punk band. I'm not sure. It might be a punk band. It's my guess. <laughs> that's that's a cheesy cover. Pretty sick. <laughs> There's a track listing. Oh. Track listing. There you go. So Venomous Concepts. This, this is a very interesting one I have in my collection now. <laughs> Never been opened yet. And it says uh, Metal Storm. I think it might be a band. So there you go. Venomous Concept. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more to go. I'm sad it's almost ending. All right. Wait, what the hell? This is just a black cover. I don't know who the hell this band is. This is a background. Who the hell is this? Oh, Ironworks. That's the name of the band, Ironworks. I had to look at the side panel to know. I've never seen a blank cover before. I think I've never heard of this one either. Um, it's just a blank cover. I think this is a track listing, or just a production. Yeah, it is. That I never heard of. It's just a black cover of something. I just don't know. It's questionable. But I know the band is called um, Ironworks. So there you go. Don't know what that is. I'll check it out later. Ah, we come to the final one. Sadly, the final one, guys. Uh, what is my last one going to be? I hope it's a Sodom album, but I doubt it, <laughs> but I'll see. Wait, what the hell? Killmet 1918? What? What the hell is this? That I never heard of before either. What the hell? <laughs> That's what I got. Okay. <laughs> I guess here's the track listing. I think they might be a punk band, my guess. Um, there you go, the whole track listing. Oh, jeez. So, uh, this is the most emotional album ever. Oh my god, really? For fans of uh, Katantonio Interpol The Cure. What the hell? I think this might be a punk band. I'm not sure. Uh, I, this is the weirdest one I have in my collection. So, there you go. And this is the final one, sadly. Alright. The box is now empty. Boosh. My favorite one so far, I'll show you the two. My favorite one so far, the first three I like. Which is this one, Brave Masima. Great album cover. This one's my favorite. I'll get to listen to that later on. I think it's pretty fucking cool. And this one's my favorite. Out of the, out of the ten. This is awesome. Anyway. Ugh, I know, this one took me so long to get this. It kept delaying like a few days, a few days, and now it finally fucking came on Tuesday. Holy shit. Um, maybe I'll consider buying another one. Another ten. I'm not sure in the future, so 
pretty cool. I just want to add some to my C collection that I have on my um, shelf right now. So, um, <laughs> that build up my collection. I was trying to get the 30, 30 plus CDs type one because um, it's a lot more than just 10, 20 more. But it's a little bit more expensive. And the shipping costs $12 for shipping. So, I might consider it one day, who knows. Hmm. But anyway, those are the two items I forgot to show you in my last video and my random 10 rock metal CDs I got and they were brand new. I'm looking forward to listing these first three that out of the 10. So I'm, I'm actually <laughs> curious about those ones. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. This took me a while to get it and here it is. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Subscribe to me if you haven't. Click the bell to get notified of the next video and comment and like about the items I got online number four and share it so I get more views and more likes and more subscribers. And I will see you, my best home friends, and my sexy little bikinis. On my next whatever I can get online number five. Who knows? Seizure? Later.